Hey friends, welcome back once again. Here I am today to tell the C++ key logger series. So in third tutorial I am tell about to how you can save the raw data which is captured by the key logger from keyboards and mouse. So let's begin. Firstly I am fix the mouse exception function. I am only capture the keyboard exception here, uh, keyboard keystroke here. I am stop the mouse capture exceptions uh, I am not capture the mouse from here so firstly I am fix this problem so I am typing you can if I am run the program and you can check if I am click the left button and right button it is basically return back the value 1 and 2 so first I am fix this I am not using this value I am not able to save this value so I am fix here firstly I am typing the if and here I am typing to or statement if keystroke 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 value is equal to equal to 1 or keystroke value is equal to equal to 2 so I am return basically 0 return 0 so it will return the 0 value back from the console window so I am run again compile first and here is problem sum I am typing if keystroke is equal to equal to 1 Oh, I'm sorry I'm not using the here and once back from ending so I am again compile and run so you can check if I am holding down the left or right key press it is not return any value so I am not use the mouse value from here basically I am only capture the keystrokes from keyboard so next I am save the raw data which is captured by the key logger so I am declaring first the file of a window file object I am use here windows object file and also make the variable to pointer that file so I am use file and point to the file output file Then semicolon. Then I am use output file equal to and I am use the inbuilt system function. That is tell about here what file work with. So I am use uh, basically use the basically f open function f open and in here I am typing point to the file and using the mode from here I am basically typing the mode append I'm and semicolon then hit enter now I am use again f printf function and here I am basically save the actual data so I am typing providing output file here basically I am this object to file object to provide here and second is I am storing which table data I am basically storing the all data into string format or character format so I am typing s because all the numeric value in which are saved in the file it is all corrected or string value so next I am providing the reference to the keystroke variable so I am typing the reference keystroke variable I am close the bracket and next here I am typing the basically save the file and almost done now we are done the almost this function 
so I am compile and run the program and you can check if I am typing A G A Y then space R A N D H A W A and close the program now I am go to the my project folder and check the log file and you can check A G A Y then I am typing space and you can check the now so in this video you can check how I am saving the file from captured by keystroke logo uh, I am in the next video basically tell about how you can hide the console window of your key logger so thank you guys for watching please subscribe my channel thank you guys